Halfway through my channel, I like to say uh, we are beamish today and if you see my channel, please like, comment and subscribe we have now hit 60 subscribers and I thank everyone of each of these thank you very much, means a lot we're in the mining bit All the miners' hats and stuff, the scuba gear and stuff. That's what you call your coal pick. There's your big battery pack. Just the one little lamp. Same lamp I've got in the house. It's a Davies lamp. lamps if I step back you'll see a bit more We're in the winding engine bit. His stationary steam engine. That would power all his conveyor belt and everything. It's a big lump of coal. 
Wer kann mir hart? Ich sehe, aber es ist still dirty. They pick out bits of rocks and stuff that isn't cool. So as you walk through them doors, you're in a different time zone. Sorry. It is 1913. 1913, the miners of County Durham held a European record for hand hewn coal, which was 41.5 million tons of coal by 105 coals. That record hasn't been beaten. Or even with the modern machinery we have today. So that's what we'd help with. So, in 1913, this was handed down to Father to serve. Now, because the world was getting round that was going to be a, a war run, they decided to put all the coal on the surface. And that's what they're doing, just in case the pigs got knocked out. They never got knocked out. But they still put all this on the surface. And that's where this record came from. Now, for one year, I said, right, we're going to have a 12 hour shift, seven days a week, and no holidays for one year. Then we revert back from a 12 hour shift to three shifts. Up, and that's what the three shifts were. Just about that. So well, that's what they were doing there. So, once the winder man and his son, they were in here, could not leave for any reason whatsoever. Not for visitors, nor the call of nature. So obviously they had to build toilets for the man here. And he's spending the best part of the shift on here, so that's where the toilet goes. And one of the jobs for his son was to empty that. And the way he emptied it, that trap door there, the stairs going down, just if, if there any maintenance wants on the head, and I'll tell you this now, whatever you see here, nothing has been added. It's still, it's still the original thing, what you see you're looking at, from 1855. Even that rally belt, what's operating this uh, machinery there, that there is 176 years old this year. That's never snapped. That's how good so, then I say, you cannot believe here whatsoever. So, we see it very soon. Get yourself over there. Three blasts, uh, this is quarter six in the morning. Three blasts on the hook to bring so many men from, from the uh, the line, from the lab room for, uh, uh, to form the queue up there to go down to the first thing we go. And that's what we would do. Now, get on six o'clock, which is where you get off the bunchman up there. Main rider. And that was brought on the three, followed by another single, and that was for that particular single call, which was six. And once again, that would, through the linkage system, would go there automatically. That's been taken away, and that's how I'm doing that. Now, 100 feet from the surface, at, at two o'clock there, He's heard that signal, not only can he hear that, he can now send signals through that linking system. And so can the rest of the, uh, what's in the shaft there. So, that will be empty, and that will come on there. So what we've got here is visual and hearing. And the sound of the bells, different sounds. That is how... Uh, Precise that this has. Once this starts, could never be interrupted. So, so we've got hearing, visual, and the sound of the bells. Now, the braking system has been taken here. The only way I can stop this is by two chalk marks. Cast your eyes up onto this big flyway there. That's 20 feet in diameter, and when it starts to move, you've got over 35 tons of moving parts, including the wooden drum that's above your head, what's got the steel on it. So that's what that is. So, for me to stop it, just off top dead centre, is by these two chalk marks. One goes underneath the braking shoes and the one on, 
on the rare bespoke way, what we call uh, um, the smoke of the way. I haven't got to be in line, it's gone past where I've just been standing, but here it's in line with the road of the way. And that's what I mean. And that's what I mean. You're yeah, alright, you're alright. Right, so I'll put that on the train, that's the red line. That'll be going down the shaft at 16 feet a second. To get rid of 200 men, it only takes 20 minutes at the most for that. Then he puts it on the coal, and that will go down the shaft at 24 feet a second. So it's back at the coal and what is in there. Fast as that one goes. That's been normally that one goes really well in the rear, but that's going down. It's not safe to go along and get a hundred feet from it. Right, that's the one that's going down. Right, not off the steam there now, but let that slow right down and I can control where I want that line to be. There it is, from the line, from the line, up to the screen, and it's stopped where it should be. So enjoy the rest of the day, I'm now going for my dinner. If you're in the vicinity, you hear three blasts from back of the of your dinner, and if you haven't seen it, by all means come back in. Okay.